What's going on, buddy? It's your problem for the CKS Day Games. Before I start this video, make sure you guys subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, stay up to date with all my motherfucking videos. Follow me on Instagram, and I'm gonna follow my band, Divided Man Shine, Spotify, everything you know will be in the description box below. Give the video a thumbs up. Just cost you guys a fucking penny and helps the channel grow, so I really appreciate it. If you hit that thumbs up button. <clears throat> all right, I now have an Amazon affiliate link. Guys, if you guys are an Amazon um, person that likes to buy a lot of shit on Amazon, I now have an affiliate link, and all you gotta do is click the link below, go to Amazon, and buy what you normally would buy, and it actually helps the channel out. So if you guys were ever wondering on how to ch help the channel out, all you gotta do is shop the Amazon link and buy what you normally would buy. It doesn't cost you anything other than what you would normally be buying. So, it's an opportunity to help the channel out. So, I really appreciate it. I also have a Weeble account uh, affiliate now. So if you guys sign up with Weeble, Weeble is a trading app for stocks. And if you guys are interested in free stocks, two free stocks, all you have to do is deposit $100 and you get two free random stocks that could range from $8 to $1,500. So no matter what, you're gonna get free money. You're gonna get free money for depositing. Um, and then guess what? You can literally cash that money out after you get the free stock and take $20 or $30 or whatever it is. It's literally free. Just sign up, all right? If you guys are interested in investing and trading and shit, I do trade and invest a lot. Um, so you guys can always DM me on Instagram and, and I can help you with any questions you may have. And other than that, let's get to the review today. Jimp. Jimp Nutrition Pre-Sesh Booster. Yay. All right. So let's go ahead and get into that. Price, mother, and point. Boom. $30 on their website. All right. $30. And that is for 30 servings. So that is on point. And guess what? You already know it. I got you guys a coupon code, Opperman Fitness, so to get you 25% off. Woo, that's a good deal. 25% off, guys. And I don't get any kickbacks or commissions or anything affiliated. It's literally a coupon code just for you guys. I don't get a penny. So um, I just, I try to get you guys the best deals. 25% off. So the price point is insanely cheap um, or reasonable, very reasonable. Under under a dollar per serving for a pre-workout, absolutely worth it you know so that's the price point and that is for everything on the website i do have a um i do have their other products which i will be reviewing so make sure you guys subscribe to the channel and stay up to date with all of my mother effing videos all right so pre-sesh let's get into that label time it's label time one scoop coming at 10.4 grams citrulline mallet three grams nice uh i don't know if it's nice but it's an okay dosage of citrulline perhaps with pumps and blood flow beta alanine two grams Nothing crazy there. I'd like to see 3.2, 2 grams. You're still going to feel some beta alanine. Creatine monohydrate, 1 gram. Don't know why it's in here. If you're going to put creatine, at least put the minimum dosage, which is like 3 or 4 grams. Actually, a lot of people like to see 5 grams, but 3 or 4, whatever. But 1 gram kind of seems very underdosed and kind of just like pointless. That's just my mother effing opinion, all right? Agmatine sulfate, 500 milligrams. Nothing really to write home with there. It's going to pair up with the citrulline, give you a little bit of pumps, a little bit of blood flow. Betaine, HCL, 500 milligrams. Going to help with overall performance and um, power output. Taurine, going to help with some some uh, some hydration action. 500 milligrams, nothing really to write home about there. Tyrosine, 500 milligrams. Going to help with some nootropic action. Choline by tartrate, 500 milligrams. Going to give you some nootropic action. All right, here we go. Caffeine and hydrous, 300 milligrams, nice and immediate energy. Hygienamine, 75 milligrams, nice and immediate energy. Short-lived boost uh, boost of energy is what that ingredient is. And then Yohimbine HCL, 2 milligrams. HCL, Yohimbine HCL, 2 milligrams. I almost said, I don't know what the hell I almost said. 2 milligrams. So 2 milligrams H, uh, of Yohimbine, nice solid dosage. I like Yohimbine. I don't like alpha Yohimbine, okay? Two different fucking things. Two different fucking ingredients. All right, this video just got flagged for, uh, I was trying to keep it low on the F-bombs and S-bombs and whatever else kind of bombs there are. So anyways, I, uh, Yohimbine is way different than alpha Yohimbine. Alpha Yohimbine makes me feel like shit. Yohimbine makes me feel like good. It makes me feel like I got to get some shit done. No side effects. I like Yohimbine. Anyways, Let's go ahead and go to the taste test segment. This is pink lemonade, pink lemonade. All right, so gonna go ahead and throw in the taste test segment and I'll wrap up my final thoughts. So here's the taste test segment. All right, this is the taste test segment on 
fuck's this pre at? Pre sesh booster by Jim Pink Lemonade Action. Pink Lemonade on my way to the gym. First time trying this. Got it ready to roll. I used uh, eh, about 16 ounces. It says 8 to 12. I kind of like pink lemonade to be a little bit more watered down. This is uh, pretty good. It's a pretty standard pink lemonade. You could tell if it was 12 ounces, it would be more tart and more pink lemonade tasting. I'm like a half an hour away from the gym, so I'm not going to drink all this right now. It's a pretty standard pink lemonade taste. If you're a fan of pink lemonade, I think you're really going to like this. There's no imperfections. There's no like aftertaste. It's a really decent pink lemonade taste, honestly. So with that being said, I have no problems giving this a solid rating. By the way, there's a little bit of shit on the bottom. I did shake it up before I pushed record. But anyways, I don't care about mixability, really. It doesn't really matter to me. But anyways, I'll give this for ratings. I'll give this. I'll give that an 8.75. It's actually pretty good. I'm not the biggest pink lemonade fan, but if I was, I would really appreciate this flavor more. So I got to call a spade a spade, 8.75 for flavor. Not my personal favorite, but it's still a good flavor. And that's uh, that's all that's all I got to say about the taste test segment. Let's get back to the other part of the review. All right, as you guys can see, it is a pretty standard pink lemonade taste. Doesn't taste like a pre-workout. It tastes pretty much like pink lemonade and it's uh, it's actually a pretty good flavor. I'm not the biggest fan of pink lemonade. I like it from time to time. It's one of those things where you get a you know you get a hunch for it, you want to try it, drink it, then you're done with it for a while again. That's that's my opinion on the whole pink lemonade thing. All right, so probably ask yourself, what are the effects? This thing looks like a standard pre-workout, right? So, what is the effects, guys? I was actually surprised with this fucking pre-workout. I was surprised. I was really surprised. I looked at the label. I was like, man, underdosed here very middle of the road there you know when i was looking at the label i'm like it's probably gonna be decent it's probably gonna be okay but it's actually better than okay so let's go and get into the beta alanine it's probably in the medium range probably low to medium it's like in the middle of the low to medium range it's not super crazy beta alanine feeling feeling but you could tell it's there you know it's not gonna you're not gonna be scratching your face off for an hour it's like comes and goes type of feeling Beta alanine's there. All right, so pumps, literally nothing to write home about. I always get pumps anyways because I have good vascularity and I already have good blood flow, but it's okay. They're okay, nothing to write home about. But the energy and focus and kind of like mind muscle connection was impressive. I ain't gonna lie, man. This is coming from a stim junkie. This is coming from a stim junkie, okay? I actually enjoyed this pre-workout. How would I classify it? Probably an effective daily driver. An effective daily driver or everyday pre-workout or whatever you want to call it. It's an effective daily driver. Like every day it was super consistent. I was mind muscle connection. I was I was focused. I had the energy to get shit done. I would say it works for around an hour to an hour and a half. And then it kind of just tapers off and it's, it's done and over with. Is it crazy stim junkie pre-workout? Absolutely not. Is it just like a, a entry level pre-workout? I would say no, like it's it's an effective daily driver. So it's like, it's not like a super beginner pre-workout, but I wouldn't classify it as a stim junkie. It's probably just an intermediate, everyday effective pre-workout. And I think it hits on pretty much all the cylinders that you're looking for in a pre-workout. And it doesn't go over the top on anything, but it doesn't really lack either. Like the pumps maybe, but I don't, I don't care about pumps. I really don't. Um, it's for what it is it's an effective pre-workout i was super surprised you know it says on the thing insane pumps i would say no insane focus i wouldn't say insane i would say good and then in extreme focus i wouldn't say extreme energy i'm sorry it says extreme energy i wouldn't say extreme energy i would just say effective energy and um it kind of just kind of just hits you not crazy it hits you and then just kind of tapers off and then that's pretty much it like it's an effective pre-workout you know how would i classify it everyday pre-workout and uh, for intermediate type of, uh, for lifters. And uh, for the price point, I was super impressed too. I didn't think I was gonna get a 25% coupon code for you guys, and I did. So this thing is less than a dollar serving, and it does hit pretty decently. So 
You know, if you're a, if you're a stim junkie, guys, it's not for stim junkies, okay? It's not for stim junkies. And, and this is coming from a stim junkie. So, guys, I, I take I take an, an absurd amount of caffeine a day, and this thing still did it, okay? So, guys, sometimes labels are just labels. This one is decent. It's a solid everyday pre-workout. Definitely would recommend it, especially for the price point. Guys, if the price point was $50, I would say, guys, pass it up because the, the price point is terrible. But the price point's on point here. So got to call a spade a spade. And that's going to be pretty much over this video. I do want to thank Jimp Nutrition for sending this over and giving me the opportunity to review it on my channel. I really, really, really appreciate it. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure you guys subscribe to the channel. Everything you need to know will be in the description box below. All my affiliate links, everything you need to know, literally. Just click the description and go through all my stuff and you guys will see it all. Other than that, there is the coupon code that will also be in the description. And other than that, we're progressing and never regressing. And other than that, I'll check you guys later.